hi! Thanks for coming over tonight. Let's do some girl talk. Okay, so first, let's start by getting ourselves a drink. And there are a few things I want to show you around the house. So let's go do that. Grab a snack, grab a drink, walk around with me, and then come right back here. So let's start out with the strawberry. This can looks way better than the can that we had on our girls' night. It was all faded. I don't know if they repackaged their packaging, if it's new, or just we got a good batch here. <laughs> but we have the strawberry, and we're going to pour it in um, this new cup that we got. We got this at Family Dollar for a dollar. And I've used it quite a few times, and there's not really any damage, so that's good. Also... There's this popcorn that we had on our night together, and it tastes really good. Now, the kernels are pretty crazy, so, you know, just to warn you about that, but it tastes just like movie theater butter, and you don't even have to pop it, and it's only a dollar. And now, look at this. Now they have this bonus bag for the same price. You get 25% more. Oh my goodness. So, I'm going to pour us a drink, get your snacks, and get ready for some girl talk. This is so good. And for only $2.50. Mm. But they're strong. So like $2.50 for like two margaritas. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So one of the things that we got this month was the dish soap dispenser and I love diluting my soaps because rather it's dish soap or laundry soap I always use more than enough soap so diluting it really helps me not waste as much and I love the bubbles another thing we got this month is this um, key holder so we got this at Ross and um, it's cast iron, so it's really nice. Another thing we got at Ross this month was this shower curtain, and it did come with the hooks. It's super nice. Um, but yeah, and I got those uh, pit portraits, by the way, at Dollar Tree. But um, yeah, I just thought it was like very simple, very nice. Then I just recycled the gift box here. Um, if you want to know what's inside, <laughs> it is um, just some like doll products. So this is just my hair kit for the dolls. Um, see, I just have a hairbrush, a little robe that I made, scissors because. Sometimes you do need to trim them. I have this little comb for styling. Then I have um, just a mini shampoo and conditioner. I really like rainbow high dolls. And whenever they have box hair, I like to give them a little trip to the salon. <laughs> so, but anyways, that's what I repurposed this box for. So, I will put everything back. Thanks again, you guys, for coming over and hanging out with me. So this week we made this drink. Well, we didn't make this drink. We made a stronger drink. Well, it's not really stronger unless you drink both the cans. But we had the strawberry and the lime burrita and we kind of mixed the two. 
I'm telling you, one is enough, but sometimes you bring two. <laughs> I hope you like my background. It's kind of like a beach theme. So um, I got a like backdrop from the dollar store. So yeah, this is only a dollar and I thought it was pretty cool. So I hope everyone had a great April. All these products that I'm going to be showing you and talking about is from the April shorts and I did a few videos. Technically the last video was like May 1st or something, but you get it. Okay, so I'm gonna put my drink down and I have my popcorn and that again, the popcorn is only a dollar. The margarita is only two dollars and you get like two and a half drinks. Here. I'm just telling you. You can still have fun on a budget. First thing, let's talk about the Family Dollar shoes. So I moved to a new location and I live by a Family Dollar now. So um, I actually got a lot of shoes there this month or April. So one of the shoes that I got was slippers. And I have lived in these slippers, let me tell you. So they are completely lived in. I lived in them like all month long, literally. So here they are. They are fluffy and super comfortable. They were only $7. Now, as you can see, it's this one's um, tearing up a little bit, but like I said, I've lived in these and they were only seven dollars so and I'm still gonna wear them I mean they're not completely torn yet and I might even buy another pair I just think that they are a really great slippers for just a few dollars and it's by the just be brand currently I'm wearing the sandals I think I got them the same day um, as these so I will insert a clip of my sandals um, but they're really cute. I've only worn them today, so I've had them on probably seven hours, so I don't know if I can give you a fair judgment, but so far, I mean, I think they're comfortable, so yeah. Also, my, um, man, he's got some slippers. Now, we got his slippers from Family Dollar as well, and his were $2.00. They were on sale for $2. Now, sometimes our Family Dollar has like closeout sales, which are like super bargain sales. So they have some items outside the door and that's where they have like the cheapest sales. So I found these and have been outside for $2 and I'm just like, oh my gosh, do you want these? Because you're not going to get a better deal than that. I got me some gym shoes there. Um... I call them gym shoes. Does anyone else call them gym shoes? Um, athletic shoes, tennis shoes, whatever you want to call them, but I call them gym shoes. But they're just like regular shoes. I needed a clean pair. So I got these. They're super comfortable. And, um, but yeah, I very, I, now this brand is Pro Player. Now my man's slippers has no name. So maybe they're just Family Dollar brand. I don't know. Um, I did like a little shop with me with Family Dollar, like a shop with me Family Dollar where I just like walked around the store and like saw like a bunch of stuff that I wanted. And during that trip, I saw the jelly shoes, like, you know, like the Y2K jelly shoes. And I was like, I hope they don't sell out. Well, on our girls night, I saw them um, for a dollar in the bin, like the outside bin, like where, like where I saw my man's shoes. So these I got for a dollar. I just can't believe it. Look at these. They are pink and sparkly and super cute. I also got them in blue. They also had them in purple. Now, they are very similar, but they're different. So here they are, side by side. Now, the pink shoe, for example, um, has diamonds on the back. Okay. Now this shoe is very, well, not very flexible, but flexible. Okay. See what you can do. And the band is very flexible. Okay. 
Then you have the blue one, which has triangles on the back. And this one is very hard and you cannot bend it. And the band is very firm too. So with that said, these shoes are not very good on hardwood floors because you're like slipping. So not very good and not very comfortable. But the pink ones are cute and comfortable. I don't know about still wearing them like on um, hardwood floors just because they're like really loud because they are a little hard. But out of the two, if you can find like the diamond crisscross ones or just test them out like this and see if they're flexible. But yeah, I was just so excited to see jelly shoes or this one's like a fake jelly shoe, but still they're cute. <laughs> We also discovered this month that YouTube has a lot of free videos with ads and you can skip the ads like you can like any other YouTube video. So just to let you know, there's so many Y2K videos like um, Just Friends, uh, uh, Just My Luck, um, and That Girl's Night. We watched uh, Sugar and Spice. I just watched last night um, Drop Dead Gorgeous. Um, but yeah, there's so many like millennial movies out there, like for free. Okay, so let's get in to some home goods. We got another cup here from Family Dollar. This was so good. I'm so glad I found this. I wish I had it in more colors. My daughter actually has the silver one and I heard my niece has the pink one. So yeah, these were only $3. I remember that. And of course I already mentioned the watermelon cup, the summer cup. I really feel like I'm at the beach right now and just having my little margarita. Or my daiquiri. So this would be good with like some ice. You can like freeze it. Actually, I've done that before. It kind of dilutes it. So, but you can add your own like tequila in it. You can make it. You can make it work. Let's talk about candles. So at Aldi's, we got these candles. There's this large one wick. There also was a two wick and a three wick. And then we have this little one. So this little one is oak and red currant smells so good it's just like it's like a floral scent i'm into floral scents i love floral scents those are my scents floral scents and um maybe candy scents but this is like a mature floral scent because it has that um oak in it mm, so nice and i'm almost done with this so then I have pink hibiscus, which you guys know I love hibiscus. So, yeah. Oh my god, this smells so good. They both smell so good. Okay, so this one is my beauty room candle. So, um, yes, this smells like my beauty room because I've associated with it. And then this one I put in my bathroom. So this one I light multiple times. And this I light one or two times a day. So, super nice look at them too like if i um like use them all up and somehow repurpose them that's a nice cup and it's solid <laughs> and there's this one okay if you guys have ever been to one of my nights um you know like as i start making the video i get really happy okay did mention this bag like I did like a little cute musical sort with this and I got this at the Dollar Tree so you can find really cute little bags like these like cosmetic bags at the Dollar Tree but when they're there and they're this cute they get picked up real quick so like I say with anything at the dollar store you better pick it up because it's you may not get it back like that cheap okay for those who watch my empties oh my dear that tea tree oil wash, oh my dear, I hope they ran it back. If they discontinued that, I will literally, I will literally cry. Okay, so I got this little jade stone in that gift box. And what I've been trying and testing out, and I think I've 
been seeing improvements. I don't know if it's just like placebo or for real, but I've been using this on my ear for like sleeper's ear. You know, like when you sleep and you have like that wrinkle on your ear. So I've been putting this, which is, um, this is also from the dollar store too. And, um, it's just like a facial massager and you can turn it on and it's like very, it's very, uh, the vibration on it's like very strong too. So if you're sensitive, like if it tickles you, then you may not want this, but I like it. So anyways, I put this on like the back of my lobe and I roll this on the front of my lobe to kind of, um, get that wrinkle out on days where like I slept too long on one side. So just wanted to share that. I also been loving this lip balm. I think this lip balm is really great. Um, what I want to use this for is like when I do like oral treatments because my mouth is so small that it cut, like it sometimes, um, stretches and cracks whenever like I do like a whitening treatment or when I'm doing like an oral cleanse, um, like with my water pick tools and stuff. So this is really good for that because it's like oversized. Um, but yeah, this was really good. Good, good. I'm not going to say too much about this because I did a whole video of me trying this for the first time, um, a cleanse with me video. So this was good though. And since I ran out of my, um, face wash, I've been using this daily. So I'm almost out. Next, this was new and I also ran out of my moisturizer. So I've been using this on the daily. This is a really um, light scent, which Kiwi Strawberry is very, you know, millennial too. And it's um, a very, uh, how do I say this? It's not thick, thin formula. It has a lot of oil in it. So it's just like very liquidy, if you will. Um, but yeah, it's nice. I also found these this April and I absolutely love them. I've been through many of these. So these are the Cucumber Extract to Soup. That's what it says. And I wish this came in a bigger pack because I use these all the time. These are so much fun. So um, there's the hand gloved one. Oh my God, this was so much fun. This is just crazy. Um, so the gift box short has me opening up this and at first I was just like, what? Because it kind of looks weird when you first open it. And then I did one exclusive, exclusively of me trying it on. So much fun. Like I, I want to get more and it's only a dollar. And then there's the foot one, which inspired our whole girls night. Okay. This was also so much fun. I, I, oh my dear, I want to get more. I also tried this out as like on my feet and usually when you get like a strong perfume, you get like sh um, a shower gel and um, a lotion. Now, um, usually those shower gels and lotions are just too potent, but what I've used with the shower gel is I use it as like a hand soak and it smells so good. And for this, I put this on after a pedicure and it's perfect. I love this scent. Mm, this is like the candy scent. I also got this. This is so pretty. This is an ex exfoliating glove and it, I just love the print. It's so, it reminds me of, um, that one show that like everyone's obsessed with, uh, not Burlington. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. Burlington. I don't know. You know, like the old shabby chic cottage core thing. Anyways, I don't watch that show because of the first thing. If you know, you know. And unfortunately, I know. I'm just, I'm just sensitive to those kind of scenes. Anyways, um, I also use this body wash that night on my legs. Oh my god, I love. I know I should shut up about this product, but I love this line. You guys know I do, so I won't talk about it too much because. I already did a video. A short. Okay. Next we have, oh my dear. This is like the best shaving cream 
ever, 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 ever. The packaging is so cute. I mean, look at this, just the perfect little pink and the, um, product is so thick. It's like shaving cream lotion. Oh my dear. And it's, you get so much of this. It's seven ounces. Now I'm used to like the, um, convenient or reasonably priced shaving cream, like pure silk. Mm -mm. Whoa. Did I just get it? Every <laughs> but yeah, Ugh. I'm just telling you this, this will spoil you and you won't go back to the other kind. I'm going to reapply my lip balm. Remember this guy from March? Love it. Um, some products, it takes you a little bit to like fall in love. Oh my dear, this is so good. Dollar store steal. Look at this. And then I have this cute eye look. Let me show you because I'm so far away you can't see it, but. <laughs> okay. This month there wasn't that much beauty, but um, we did try out this, this mascara from Great Lash Omer. This is such a good classic mascara. Like, if you don't want, you know, anything, you just want, like, just give me mascara, this is your mascara. And you really don't need anything else. This is so nice. I'm just, everything you want out of mascara is this. Now, if you want, um to have fun with a different type of mascara, go ahead, go buy it, go test it out, but you should always keep this in your um, collection. And last, we have this nail polish. We tried this, um, but it was just too sheer. So I like my nail polishes thick. This was just super thin. Currently, I have this on my toes, which is pink blink. Yeah. Well, thanks for coming over tonight and having a little girl talk. I hope you enjoyed our time together and stay tuned because I have some hauls coming up. Um, so yeah, if you enjoy, um, I'm going to put all these products away. Thank you.